hey guys welcome back so it's 6 p.m and i'm just closing from the office and about heading home so yeah i get to join the office shuttle which basically drops you at home and it leaves around six that's why i close it this time So today we had some colleagues that got promoted and they shared food which this is mine and I'm going to eat it in the bus. One thing I like about joining the office shuttle is that you get to still work because basically you're in a safe space with AC and everything so I continue working until I get home. This is 8pm and your girl is just approaching our house. I really like it though. Yes. How was your day, Mama? My baby. Boo boo. You not answer me. Bye bye. How was your day? How was your day? Was it fine? Eh, Mama. You push your leave. So one thing that is important for me is that I still get to spend some time with baby girl because at the end of the day, it's really what matters, get to bond. I get as much time as I can with her before going to bed, especially because I have to wake up very early the next day. <laughs> so yeah, we do not play with these opportunities for us to bond and spend time together. I'm going to have tea this evening because as you saw, I already had dinner in the car. Though I couldn't finish it, I ate about half so I tried. So there's no need for me to eat food again, but a normal day would have warmed uh, one of the meals that I meal prepped during the weekend and just have dinner. Mama, come and say Mama. bye. So yeah, that's basically what a day in like what an evening routine for a working mom is it's really the commute the getting back spending time with baby when my husband is around i will most likely maybe warm something for him because i do not cook every single night that i get back i prep everything over the weekend then we'll have a little bit of family time and then yeah go to bed but this is the basics so yeah morning guys it's thursday morning i'm coming with a messy room with a tired face because i'm truly tired yesterday i go home almost 11 pm yeah i left my office late i left my office quarter past eight and that's because i knew i wasn't going in today i was going to work from home and there are just some tasks that you need to accomplish with people's physical presence so i was trying to like complete those ones so that today will be less stressful but tell me why after leaving vi past it i still met traffic all the way in lekki from it's not even second roundabout i just have that first roundabout all the way to chakondi i spent three hours i spent three hours it was just like what is this there's no corner road i didn't use there's no nothing it's well shower so yeah it's morning it has a trend it's trying to sit on a chair to do a proper work from home this thing i'm just going to sit on the floor my system is here i will work but i will pace myself because god knows i'm tired i'll just take you guys through today in completion of the previous video um which was i was taking you through my evening routine coming back from work then i'll take you through the day um, there's a few things I want to do, so yeah, I'll just carry you guys along. I actually want to start a healthy journey. I've actually started in terms of how I eat, though it's not yet perfect. I've been eating rice. I think I should go back to my no rice thing, though that's going to be stressful, but I think I can do it. Maybe I should try a month without any rice, without any rice, any bread. I love salad and I like having my salad with a little bit of bread. God will help me. But like, 
I'm actually trying to stay away even from swallow. I made vegetable soups and I've been eating the soup like that without any swallow. I just want to try. But later this evening, when I'm done working, I want to go for a walk. I want to just, yeah, put in a bit of effort. I keep making excuses. Oh, the road in my estate is not so good. Blah, blah, blah. But people are still working out. Oh, I come home very late. I go to work very late. But what of weekend? What of the days that I work from home? I was so tired. I would have gone for a walk this early morning, but I was so exhausted. I didn't wake up till seven thirty because God knows I was tired. But yes, yeah, so I'll do the evening version. I also want to complete uh, buying my toiletries and possibly see if I can book an appointment with an optician because my eyes. We've been through a lot so yeah all those different things i'll take you guys along on how the day goes see ya hey guys so i came out to work for that i've had breakfast unfortunately i didn't show it was just bread and avocado and toast just basic um i'm still working basically just exhausted like trying to do as much as possible most likely in the afternoon in the latter part when i want to step out i'll step out my system i'm actually thinking i would also go and take out my nails like these nails have stayed for so long and i have a very busy weekend if i can actually make my nails today it will help because i need to make my hair i'm going out on saturday and then well it's not like an outing outing it's just for children's day but i can't go out like this i just did this to hold for the week so if i can get the nails out of it most likely my brows as well it would be really helpful so yeah few things i wanted to achieve but i didn't achieve all of them so yes my work from home i achieved that um i went out to buy a few things for the house which i'm going to show you guys but i couldn't go to the clinic because when i by the time i went to make my nails if you can see it took so long i don't know how i thought i was going to be able to do all of that in one day but by the time i was done making my nails there was no time for me to go to the clinic so i'll try and do that over the weekend so in terms of what i bought i bought a few things which i'll show you guys i got my shower gel you know in the other video i showed a shower gel which i said was just to keep in baby's room so this is my actual shower gel same types i buy any of the um different types of shower same types. i also got my body lotion which is sanitized i got my bar soap i use this bar soap so i alternate between the shower gel and the bar soap so this is the bar soap i always use then i also got this cadbury hot chocolate i take it to the office to do tea especially because my office is so cold so yeah i got some to stash up in the office then i got this um what do you call it mosquito repellent or spray i tell you what to call it this is good night i like it because it doesn't have a choky smell so i always buy this either this one or the lemon flavor so yeah i also got hypo which is the big one so i tend to buy this big one nowadays because it literally lasts me so long this big one is two five yes it's two five and Mm -mm. it's now three thousand this big one is three thousand and it lasts me like three months but when i used to buy that small one it doesn't last as much as three and a half liters so it's a lot and i bought sunlight detergent which is two five i buy this for adult clothes at home and i buy ariel for baby girl then i bought this 
Vim. Well, this is not the Vim brand, but it's Sha the powder scoring or the scoring powder. This is so good. Like, if you need to clean some tough areas in your kitchen, your bathroom, from I promise, buy this. You'll be happy. Whichever brand, but like, just pour it, put your cleaning um, solution, and just little scrubs, and it's gone. So I also got tissue paper. I bought half a carton. Like, I don't understand. Like the fact that they said a full pack has eight of these like eight packs like this so half just has four i was like ah, i thought the full pack will have like i don't know 20 and then half will have like 10 but it's just four anyway so i got four of these i also got bottle water but i can't carry that so i just bought a few so yeah that literally ends this vlog hope you guys are enjoying this uh lifestyle vlogs i'm trying to do nowadays i used to do weekly vlogs but now i'm just going to be doing like batch of vlogs because i don't know the sit down videos aren't necessarily doing the way i want and yeah i feel like the vlogs are doing better and with how busy i am these days it's just easier to like do some vlogs and take you guys along what we do if there's a topic that comes up that i really want us to talk about i would make a sit down video but for now i think we're going to be doing more of vlogs let me know in the comment section down below if you think we should do it otherwise or yeah like if you like this idea of doing more vlogs let me know so yeah, thank you so much guys for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!